First up, porpoising may cause brain damage. Yes, you heard that correctly. Out of the mouth of the totonator himself, Mr. Wolf has claimed that medical studies done by the FIA have shown that porpoising may cause brain damage in Formula 1 drivers. Just in time for the mid-season break in the calendar, the FIA plans to introduce Technical Directive TD039 into full force at Spa in a few weeks' time to clamp down on the bouncing scene in F1 cars this season. What exactly did the Totonator say? The FIA has commissioned medical work on the porpoising. The summary of the doctors is that frequency of 1 to 2 Hz sustained over a few minutes can lead to brain damage. We have 6 to 7 Hz over several hours, so the answer is very easy. The FIA needs to do something about it. I still fundamentally believe that there is no choice for the FIA and for us to do something. Well, if indeed this is correct, the FIA do have no choice but to act. Or they may be facing a grid full of rebellious drivers refusing to compete. I mean, it's one thing risking your life at a 300 km plus an hour, but to add brain damage into the mix for no reason is just going too far. Ricardo to Alpine. The Alonso Piastri Alpine Circus is getting even more curious now. Otmar Schaffnauer has admitted that our favorite Aussie would be a good recommendation if Piastri continues to give Alpine the cold shoulder for 2023. With Piastri seemingly not interested at all in racing for the French outfit and Ricardo having been there a few seasons ago before joining the Papayas, he now seems a good fit as his relationship with McLaren has seemingly soured due to him not getting as much out of the car as teammate Lando Norris. McLaren boss Zach Brown has spoken of mechanisms in Ricardo's contract which would allow him to leave the Orange team before the end of his contract at the end of 2023. Piastri may very well have his eye on Ricardo's seat and a deal to see Daniel join Alpine may then very well turn out to be good for all involved. Schaffner was quoted as saying, give us some time, Oscar is our number one candidate, we haven't got to the what if it's not Oscar stage, but a lot of drivers have called and Ricardo is a good recommendation. Headlines Vettel annoyed Ferrari. Former Ferrari press officer Alberto Antonini said that Seb Vettel annoyed the little horses when he joined them with his curious nature and he's trying to instill his Red Bull methods at Ferrari. Maybe they would have won something if they listened there. Eh? Ricardo in talks with four teams. According to ESPN, the potential toothpaste model has had interest from four teams in the last few weeks, as news of McLaren's seeming unhappiness about his performances have been reported. No news on who the four teams are, though. Thought for the week, Isaiah 4031. But those who hope in the Lord will renew their strength. They will soar on wings like eagles. They will run and not grow weary. They will walk and not be faint. Leaving you with the memes, enjoy the couple of weeks that we have no races, which will make you appreciate the weeks when we do. God bless, please hit up that sub button and come back again next week. We will have something new for you. God bless.